After dropping Hunt the Front as one of the teams they were sponsoring, Langenfelter Mechanical has announced a new sponsorship deal with Tyler Herb. Before we get to this, I'd like to ask you, please hit that subscribe button, hit that bell for notifications so you don't miss any of our future videos here at John Trent Racing. So we have this post here, May 10, from Langenfelder Mechanical Incorporated, one of the top sponsors or one of the uh, former top sponsors for the Hunt the Front car. And they, Langenfelder Mechanical posted this as of today. We are no longer affiliated with Hunt the Front. I feel betrayed, and I'll leave it at that karma. They have this Pierce Brosnan meme saying, sometimes your value isn't seen until your absence is felt. Clearly not happy with the way everything went down. And we got some more details about that as well. In the comment section of that post, uh, they responded to Tyson Brown saying, Hunt the Front will be fine. They have Kubota backing them. But I was the last to know classless Jesus lives. Obviously taking a shot at Hunt the Front because they have that Jesus lives logo uh, that they have on their car. And uh, really not happy with the, with the fact that uh, he was uninformed, or at least not maybe uninformed, but informed last uh, about the Kubota deal. Uh, he also posted this here, saying it's the way they handled it. Wanted to get my side out because I figured it wouldn't be told. How would you feel if you invested $200,000 plus? We agreed on locations of my company's logo placements, then told that they were putting me elsewhere. So yes, I'm pissed. Picture show b below showing new logo location. If handled properly, we could have worked out. So you can see that uh, his logo was going to be moved from the uh, quarter panels to, uh, I guess, uh, right b beside the fenders, on the fenders. And then uh, his logo would also have been removed from the hood of the car because it was previously on the hood of the car. So Kubota took the hood and the um, quarter panels there, and they were going to give Langenfelter the... Um, Defenders. And then Hunt the Front uh, confirmed all of this in a post on May 14th. Said, we would like to take a second to say thank you to Langenfelder Mechanical Contractors for all the support they've given our race team over the past three years. Unfortunately, all good things must come to an end, and they've decided to go a different direction. We wish them the best in the future. We're looking forward to what's next for our program. And then on May 17th, just a three days ago, uh, Hunt the Front announced this. Y'all help us welcome Kubota Tractor Corporation to the team. We're thankful to have Kubota on board as the presenting sponsor of the Hunt the Front YouTube channel and the primary sponsor of our race team. Most of you have probably seen Kubota popping up all over dirt track racing the last month or two. It's all part of an investment Kubota is making in our sport, and we're thrilled to be a part of it. Most importantly, we're proud to represent a brand that's committed to serving rural America and supporting the things we're most passionate about, like dirt track racing. With that said, here's our new look. We love the orange. Y'all let us know what you think. And then obviously you can see very similar to what had been uh, scoped out there for Langenfelder Mechanical. Obviously, Langenfelder is not on the um, front fender there. It looks like they do have a space available for a, another sponsor there. But you can see Kubota is on the quarter panels, and is on the hood, and then has, it's, you can't really tell it's on the hood, or uh, excuse me, on the roof, but it is on the roof as well. So with all of that happening, Langenfelter now has a new uh, partner or a team driver that they are sponsoring. They posted this just a couple hours ago. We are proud to announce that we are supporting Tyler Erb, number one, along with Gary Stuller. Please support them with T-shirts, etc. One is a Hall of Famer. Other is a future Hall of Famer. I'm not sure where exactly this uh, um, photo was from. I know that uh, I believe that Tyler Erb did just win a $5,000 to win race this past weekend at Lawrenceburg. Uh, so uh, fresh off a win, Tyler Herb now has a new sponsor in Langenfelter Mechanical Incorporated. So let me know what you guys make of this. Let me know in the comments below.